Hello friends and welcome back to German Beer Adventures Channel. Today it's all about dark beer or Schwarzer beer, black beer, dunkel beer, dark beer. And in Germany this describes any beer that is from pale brown to black usually in color but more to the darker end of the scale. Until the 19th century most beers were dark in color. But after the advent of our golden ale the tide started to shift slightly and uh, dark beer became less common and now again they are becoming more popular so they're coming back into style. Uh, most of these feature roasted malt, caramel, wonderful flavor. Some have a lot more body than others which we're going to talk about in, in a moment and um, many of these come from the Getrinke mark, not necessarily in the uh, supermarket. So they're more of a in a specialty store, like uh, this one, this one, and these two here. We're going to talk about all of them. I want to start from left to right. This is probably for me the lightest tasting one. This is Kotfriga, and it's a Schwarzer beer. So it's a black a black beer, and this has been brewed since 1993. And Bitburger actually bought the company in 1991 and we know Bitburger is well known for their other classic beers, Pilsner in, in particular. Um, uh, so this was established in 1993, Coach, Coach Ringer Brown and it's, it's very popular. I like it but uh, it is not as full body as the others and of course it, it should not be because it says Swartzer beer because now we will come to Something more on the uh, uh, heavier side, Mars Brau, M A H R S B R A U E T A, Dunkless Lager, uh, which is 5%. This is about the same percentage also. And uh, you can taste the malt and hops, some hops in it also, not just a uh, malt taste. It's very good, but it's a uh, Coming up the ladder to what is more full body, it depends on what you like. I, I like more full body. And it's very good, but we're going to go to now Joseph Bach. And I got to look at the label on this one. It says Shushen Rida Browery. S-C-H-U-S-S-E-N-R-I-E-D-E-R. -S -S -E -E Shushen Rida Browery. In the flip top, very good seal, very good tasting beer. Nice, strong body, nice taste. And now to the award winning Zapfen Duster. It's a deep black 8.5% with plenty roasted malt. It's really, really good. Full taste of chocolate and coffee. And you can, you can really taste it. And it says won the International Craft Beer Award for 2020. And rightfully so, I think. I think you'll like this one if you like full solid body. And this is a porter actually, Lausitzer 4.4 percent porter. Now it's a little bit sweet for me but it's a good medium body. Uh, uh, well well done I think uh, and uh, uh, I like more not 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 quite as sweet as this one is but it's very good for what it is. Now I've never tasted this one this one is Zottler beer, St. Stephen's Bach, Dunkless Stark beer. It says, the oldest family brewery in the world since 1447, St. Stephen's Bach, Zalta beer. So we're going to try that right here today and see how it is. It is 7.1% 7, 7 and it says dark strong beer, dark double Bach, roasted malt coffee and chocolate. I can taste it now. I think that's going to be some nice body to it. I did taste this brand before but in an export which was very good. Now friends I left this one for last. <laughs> if you like it bold I'll say in your face, solid I'll bring out all the adjectives, robust, full excellent body. This is 10 percent and it's called Noctus 100. Beer specialist since 1386. On the front you can see it says Schwarzer Geheimnis, Black Secret, and it was until I found it, and I'm glad I did. 
uh, massive body and heavy. I have, so far I've drank about 300 different German beers and maybe 50 of those are dark beers and stouts type. And there is nothing that comes close to this, but you pay the 10%. 10% alcohol price. It is 0.66 of a liter. So what I do is 0.66 is 24 ounces. I will drink half today and half the next day. 12 ounces today and 12 the next day because it's 10%. One day, I, one evening I did drink, drink it all in one shot. Needless to say for me, I slept very well. So let's try this one first here, but I never tried before. And then I'll show you the body of this also, because if I drink this before this, I got a feeling this might not be so strong tasting or full, full tasting. So let's see how this one tastes. Live and direct, unscripted, uninhibited, unbiased. Let's do it. Looks good. Very good. And so it is. Good body. And what is it? 7.1%. So we're going to step up to the 10%. It seems to me the flavor moves up the chain with the amount of alcohol in it. And that just seems to be the way it is. Very good. Now I want to show you this big bad boy here. You can see the color is just <laughs> the color is just strong, dark, solid. And so is the flavor. So I will go out on a limb and say this is the most tastiest beer I've ever drank. But I would say, for me, it's not every, an everyday beer, maybe three or four times a year, special occasion, because I look at it as a treat. This does come under the craft beer uh, category, but it does not carry a craft beer price. The price is extremely reasonable for what this is. And you can see, solid. That is very, very good. If you ever see it, ever get a chance to try it, then I highly recommend it if you like, like they say, aroma, a uh, bit of chocolate with coffee note. That is correct. Uh, Irish Ale Hefe, 10% uh, by volume, alcohol, and full color, 10%, Noctus 100 that is the one to beat for flavor. I promise you. They didn't pay me to say this. I don't even know who Noctis 100 is. Or it says, Regalia Beer Manufacturer. Brow special, Specialist since 1386. Noctis 100. And there it is. 0.66 of a liter, so about 24 ounces of flavor. And if you're drinking your beer because you like how it tastes, you like flavor, well, there's the one in the dark beer category. So friends, I hope you enjoyed this short video and seeing a few different German uh, dark beers here, which there are many, but I can only show so many at a time. And if you like this uh, little skit, give me a like, smash the like button. Maybe share it with your friends and hit the notification button so you'll know when a new video is available. Uh, I'm going to taste it one more time and just savor it. Very good. The thing is, to go back to anything else is very good in, in its own right, but you can see they're close, but much, much more body there. Okay, friends, so remember, if you drink, don't drive. Don't operate any machinery. Drink in moderation. Stay well. We'll see you on the next video. So thank you for watching.
Dankeschön, auf Wiedersehen. Tschüss.